Hey everyone, welcome back to Core Keeper. So this is the Atlantean Worm Chest. It looks pretty cool. This is probably my favorite one. I like the color white. Uh, but today, I think we might try to tackle Earth Slime here. Uh, right now, I'm just planning on kind of feeling things out. So we're just going to go at it without too much planning. This is like my entire inventory right now. I have set this way because uh, my respawn point is actually still here. So if I die to these slimes, I should technically spawn back at that point. <laughs> so... Oh, do they not attack me now? Wait, that's crazy. Am I too strong for them? Oh. Once they get going, they do attack me. Oh, damn. This is, uh, there's a failure to this plan. Hold up. <laughs> Did the blue ones attack me? They don't either. Huh. Well then. Um... Okay. <laughs> We're gonna find some mobs that do attack us. There's nothing here yet. I'm not even sure if this works. <laughs> Would I be able to make it down there by the time he comes around? Maybe. Maybe it'll just like... So yeah, maybe we'll just dash towards him. I probably should keep this King Scent armor set on, just so I can dash around and see if I can dodge some of his attacks. Because again, I don't know what it is, I don't know the attack patterns, I don't know how big it is, so we'll see. Come on. Oh, I should be able to make it. And with the Atlantean worm part thing, I made some food. Uh, this thing over here. Plus 136 max health for 10 minutes, and then obviously the plus 100 permanent max health. Um, so I don't want to use it right now when I'm just testing the waters. But it is pretty good. Uh, it's down here. Let's eat some regular food. Okay, where is it? Oh! Ah, I might be a little bit too late. Maybe? Because I also have to watch out for all the other enemies around this area too, right? So, like, these little assholes. I say little, but oh. They're not little at all. Oh, what the f- mm, okay. Damn it! Um... Good news, bad news. I respawn here. Bad news. Ah, uh, he's so close! Ah! Uh, go, 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 go! Come on, come on, come on. Oh my god, what the hell is that? I just re dashed right into him. And then I died. <laughs> my uh, armor durability is not looking good. So, there's that. That's like a rolling mass of whatever that is. Let's see if we can keep up. 
Kamal. Where did it go? Come on! We were so close! I guess this is like a Gorm kind of situation where he just like... Does he phase through walls though? I think he does. Frick! It might be too late. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's way too late. I try still, but I don't think I can catch up to him. Even with this dash. We're gonna have to wait for it. I'm gonna maybe explore this place a little bit while we wait for it just to see if we can find any of those more uh, ancient ruins again. Okay, so that guy takes forever to circle around the map. Uh, it actually gave me enough time to get some drills on some of these things. I ran out of Scarlet Bars, so that's why I only have five here. But for the other one, I filled it with the regular drills. He seems to be coming this way though, so what we are going to do... I'm actually going to, actually going to try the summoning set this time, just for fun. See how it works out. Uh, because there's no summoning requirement for this guy. So we're just going to... Cuss. Well, first, switch to summoning set. And then summon some jellyfish. And then we'll see how that goes. I'll try not to use the Stormbringer, I suppose. Um, because it seems like it's a little bit cheaty. But we'll see. This is just going to be a test run anyways. And he's at my first drill at the moment. Uh, so yeah, let's go. Let's meet him halfway. Oh. What the frick? Oh my god. Go away, not the time. Oh my god, it has multiple eyes or whatever. What the frick is this? Is this the entire boss? No way, there's gotta be like a phase 2 or something. Oh, there's multiple. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I see how it is. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, it's coming along this way. We are at probably like the narrowest part of our explored area. With the exception of this, so we gotta look out for this. Um, but let's start summoning stuff in anticipation for when that boss arrives. It was quite a long wait. I, I kind of just stayed in this area because I was just watching a live stream. Um, or a recording of a live stream. But probably took around like 15 minutes for it to come back. So, yeah. That's a long last wait. Good news is, it's... it's slow. So... Should be able to outrun it, maybe? Uh, I don't want to go chasing after it. I should not be standing so close to the wall, either. Here we go. Oh, it's still damaged somewhat. 
from uh, our previous bout. Okay. I don't think it's activated yet. <laughs> it's just like rolling around. But uh, I think we have to defeat these eyeball things first. I'm not sure if there's another one up there. Oh, this is cutting it close. This is the area I was afraid of. So after this should be fine, right? Oh, what the frick? Ew. Oh, maybe it's just like... We have to repeat that process and then like we have to defeat all those um, orbs. And then this, the main... Okay. God damn, this guy has messed me up. Let's see obliteration rate. Uh, it works not that quickly. Uh oh. It works on these guys, that's for sure. Um. God damn. Go away. <laughs> I'm gonna maybe try to obliteration or um, what's it called? Stormbringer the next time the main head comes out. Cause if this is all the bosses, it's not too hard, it's just annoying. Like this part, I'm dead. Can't believe I got out of that. And then one more. Oh, nope, stuck. Get ready. We can even do this. We do not have enough damage. <laughs> I don't know what that achievement said. I can't read it right now. But this is a good way to level up our uh, minion or summoning stat, I suppose. Assuming I don't die. Let's get the one up there first. Seems harder to get to. <clears throat> yeah, talent level and summoning. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm dead. I messed up there. Uh. Ooh, I don't think I'll be able to chase after it. So, I'll have to see how much it regens when it rolls back around, but I guess I'm just going to watch another like 10-15 minutes of live stream. I'll actually time it this time.
Uh, okay. Yeah, I was reaching the end of my path there anyways. So, I'll be back again. Okay, yeah, so it's been about 13 minutes now. Uh, I'm making my way back towards it while avoiding these assholes. Ah, uh, let's use the healing potion. He's actually pretty close. I might just wait for him here and start summoning my stuff. <clears throat> I actually went home and made a uh, pandem pandorium. Oh my god. Shit. I hate these uh, mob monsters. They always ambush me whenever whenever I'm in my inventory. God damn. Let's heal as well. And this time I actually brought the... Oh, never mind. Let's kind of anticipate it a little bit here. Okay. It's up here. It regen. I brought this. We need attack right now. <clears throat> oh. Shit. Oh no, I'm dead. <laughs> that was the right idea. Um, I basically equipped the glass bead ring here for plus thirty percent more damage. But I think I'm gonna have to end it here. I'll, I'll pick one stuff. But I think I'm going to have to end it here. I just don't have enough damage right now. But uh, I'll have to think of some other solutions. Investigate, see if there's any other like food buff items that we can... We can uh, utilize. There's also some level ups that we have to do. Like ranged combat. We, have, we apparently maxed out the level. Oh, that might be the pop-up we got when, we, uh, when I was too busy to look at it. Okay. Um... We can do that. I kind of want to reset it though. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's do some level ups. <laughs> we'll level this up to the max, I suppose, and then plus crit damage. I kind of don't really care about the stun too much, honestly, so I might just do a path like this. Melee damage. We can level it up a little bit more. That might be useful. Summoning would be pretty useful as well. Magic damage increase. Does uh, the Grim... Okay, yeah, that would be useful. Plus Magic Bearer for per active minion. That is helpful as well for survivability. Uh... I kind of want all three of these, actually. Let's do that. And then, yeah, I guess I'll end the video here. Unless I try again. Uh, but it's another, like, 13 minute wait. <laughs> Regardless, I'll pick up my stuff first and then we'll see. Okay, so I finished editing the video, but I realized I only had about, like, 19 minutes on the video. So I figured I'd tackle this boss again. 
This has, it's been a week since I've tried this, so let's give it another try. Right now, uh, off screen, what I did was I explored this path a little bit more. And I kind of built out some areas for, ex I kind of, kind of tore a hole through here. Um, built a couple bridges here, that way we won't be as trapped easily when we are on this side. But... Yeah, I know that technically if I switch this gear and use some other equipment, I might have easier time with it, but I really want to try the summoning set and try to beat it with the summoning set. And right now we have a bunch of food items here. Uh, one of the s most useful ones I'd say is this one, the Juicy Tropics Smoothie, which gives plus 22.4 physical melee damage for 10 minutes. Uh, and then there's also this one, which gives plus 30 minion damage for 10 minutes. So I'm heavily relying on some of the food items. And we'll see what happens, I suppose. Which ring is this? Ah, this might come in handy. I guess I put the glass ring back home. Uh, if that's the case, then maybe I'll take this one and possibly put it on here when I need it. I do have the uh, dash feather here just so we can get away. Uh, this gives armor, this, gi this gives percentage armor. We're going to kind of meet it halfway, ideally roughly over here. Uh, and then I will meet you guys when we get there and start fighting him. I should eat some food. One of the problems I had earlier as well is um, my food kept on dipping below a threshold, so my damage is getting lowered. So I need to watch out for that this time. Okay, so he's almost here. We are going to start taking some of the longer lasting food items, like this one. And then we're going to put armor up here, or healing up here. Uh, maybe no here. And then we can start summoning. Not a good path. Go. Gotta meet it over here, I suppose. Or we can start shooting. There are some narrow paths in this area, so I have to be careful about where I'm going. Ah, pet reached level 10. Nice. Oh, like this area. And then after that, it should open up a little bit more. Oh, my mistake. Down here again. <laughs> and then now it should open up a little bit more. Oh my god, not the time. Let's drink that. Oh my god. Screw off, guys. The mobs are so annoying this fight. Oh crap. Ow. Oh, frick. Dashed right into it. Okay, I went up a little bit more north this time, so we are kind of in unknown territory. But I think we are going to face him down right here. Let's give this another try. <laughs> I feel like I have a lot more trouble with the mob monsters more than anything in this biome. Because they just keep swarming at you. Uh, but we'll start summoning our stuff here. I don't have exactly the same food, but um, the effects that I have from the food that I do have should be roughly the same as the ones I showed you.
And for some of the ones like these, this one for like the 10 minute ones, I might just... Ah, uh, well, it's hard to say because usually if it's a regular boss, I'd say it's definitely not going to take 10 minutes, but for this one, it's hard to say. Let's try to engage it a little bit further along as well. Oh, this is a temple thing. I should uh, mark that down then. Quickly. <laughs> so, for instance, this one it lasts for 10 minutes. I should take that. This lasts for 10 minutes. I should take as well. These guys a little bit better this way. Resummon. Oh, this is a little bit dicey. Oh, it better not be in the wall. Okay. Okay, so we need to do that like, what, five more times? Summon a few of the things. This is a uh, tight. Ooh, that was dangerous. Let's resummon. Yep, this one. Uh, I have to be careful here, the passage gets very narrow. Yep. And let's resummon. Oh my god. Go away. There's gonna be more of them too. Let's heal. Oh, it's gonna take more than five more times. God damn. I wonder if it kills the other mob monsters too. Doesn't seem like it. Uh, maybe it did. Uh oh. Bad pathing on my part. This is going to take a while. Uh, it's going well though. Decently well. Let's not screw it up by uh, being too overconfident though.
Oh, we gotta heal it. I'd rather it hit it, the enemy though, but... Okay, gotta resummon these. It's definitely hard to juggle this uh, summoning thing while we're trying to um, juggle everything else. Really tense right now, not saying too much. I don't want to mess this up right at the last minute. Oh no. Uh, this area is going to be a little bit more dangerous. Uh oh. Uh, no, 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 no. That was too close. Oh my god. These goddamn mob monsters. Ah, damn it. Ah, oh, oh, firing the wrong way. Oh, it's getting faster. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> uh, I leave in defeat. <laughs> okay, before I end the video, I figured I'd just explore this a little bit. Uh, if it's anything like the last one, it's going to be pretty small in size, I believe. That mining damage too low. There's a chest here. Goddamn blindfold again. Uh. Okay. Let's break this. I was hoping for more than one chest. Not gonna lie. Uh, and then that's just outside the walls. Okay, so. Nothing good. <laughs> so I think I'll end the video here. Thank you for watching. Remember to hit the like, share, and subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye. I'm gonna destroy this temple for getting my hopes up.